Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well. My name is Palina and today I will show you guys my favorite red lipsticks in my collection. Red is a very beautiful, strong, fierce and bold color and red lipsticks are my favorite lipsticks in my collection. I'm wearing a red lip today to my Valentine's Day makeup look. I really like to wear red lipstick whenever I wear it, it makes me feel beautiful and feel confident and really catch the attention of the whole look and I really love wearing red. Let me know what is your favorite red lipstick and let's get started. The first lipstick I selected is a very famous MAC Ruby Woo. I have it in a limited edition packaging from the MAC X Angel Chan collection. This is a very bold and intense blue toned red lipstick that applies on the lips very matte and pigmented. I love the look it gives me, it's a very beautiful stunning color. The only thing is that the lipstick is a little bit stiff so it can be hard to apply and can feel dry on the lips. But the color is really gorgeous and it's one of my favorite red lipsticks of all time. I'm going to sort the order of the lip products by their brand, so the next one is also a MAC lipstick. This is a MAC matte lipstick in the shade Chili, which is very popular worldwide and especially in Asia. This is a warm toned orange red lip color with a hint of brown in it. It comes in a matte finish that is very easy to apply on the lips, goes on really smooth, pigmented and doesn't feel drying. I like this lipstick a lot because it's not too bold, not too bright. I don't have to worry about not being able to pull this lipstick off. I can wear it to any daily looks. And also it complements my warm skin tone very well. Sometimes I like to dot a little bit on my cheeks and blend it out like a blush. Fun fact, this is also my first MAC lipstick and as you can see I did good progress on it. I'm almost done with the lipstick. And now for the last lipstick from MAC. This is a MAC Powder Kiss lipstick in the shade Devoted to Chili. I also have it in a limited edition packaging. This is like the cousin of Chili. The formula is different. This one goes onto your lips super easily, applies really smooth, gives you a matte finish but very moisturizing and feels very light and thin on your lips. It doesn't feel heavy at all, doesn't feel dry. But the color is more sheer. It's not as pigmented and intense. Some people call it an upgrade of Chili. And now we have the Gucci Rouge à Livre Froid lipstick in the shade 25 Goldie Red. There, I did it. This is a beautiful sheer orange red lip color that is see-through and glowy. You can layer it up to get a more pigmented finish if you want to. I love everything about this lipstick. The vintage flower wallpaper design on the case is very pretty. The lipstick inside weighs a little bit, feels heavier than any other lipstick I've tried and I like that. I also really love the color and the formula of the lipstick. It's glowy, it's sheer, a little bit see-through, feels very moisturizing on the lips. I can wear it all day, it feels comfortable, feels lightweight, doesn't dry my lips out at all. I can even wear it on days where I'm not wearing any makeup. It feels natural, it looks natural and I really I really like to wear this lipstick. I'm excited to try more shades from them. And the next product is a Chanel Rouge Allure lipstick in the shade 99 Pirate. It comes in a black metal click to open case and is a beautiful blue toned red color in a sudden finish. A friend gifted me this lipstick and I really like the color and the formula of the lipstick. It's a very bold, intense and gorgeous red color with some blue undertones to it. The formula is very nice, it feels very easy to apply on the lips, feels moisturizing, feels like a balm. It feels very comfortable on the lips, it's very pigmented, but I don't wear this lipstick often because I feel like I can't pull the look off, it's such an intense color, I can't pull it off, but on some days where I feel confident, I would take the lipstick and put it on my lips. It's such a gorgeous red color. And the next product is also a Chanel lipstick my friend gifted me. This is a Chanel Rouge Allure Velvet Extreme Lipstick in the shade 110. Impressive. It's a beautiful, very bright and bold orange red color that is more on the orange side compared to my other orange red lipsticks. Just like the product's name says, this is an extremely matte lipstick that gives you an extremely matte finish to your lip color. It looks very nice, but it will feel drying on your lips if you wear it for a long time. I don't mind it being dry, I really love the color and the finish of the lipstick. It makes me feel confident to wear this color to my look sometimes. It's such a beautiful, bold and bright orange red color. It's very different, it's very interesting, I love this lip color. And the next product is a Nude Sticks Intense Matte Lip Plus Cheek Pencil in the shade Stiletto. This is the first color I've tried for Nude Sticks and I already finished one of these. This is my second one now. 
This lip crayon is like a 3-in-1 product. You can wear it as a lipstick, you can use it as a lip liner, you can wear it as a blush. Just dot a little bit onto your cheeks and blend it out. It's very easily blendable, it feels very comfortable to wear on the lips. The thing I really like about this product is that it gives me really intense and pigmented color, a really nice matte finish, but doesn't feel drying on the lips at all. Feels very comfortable to wear, feels very moisturizing, doesn't feel dry even if I wear it for hours. The only thing is that this lip crayon is not good for the summertime. When it's hot outside, the lip crayon would get very soft and feels like it's going to break apart on your lips when you try to apply it. But other than that, I really love this product. It's very comfortable to wear, I love the color. And now for the last and final product, this is the Armani Beauty Lip Maestro in the shade 400 Z Red. This is the reddest red I have in my collection, this is the most pigmented, intense red I have. This is a gorgeous blue toned red color, it's super intense, super pigmented, it goes onto my lips super easily, I get full pigmentation in one single stroke, it feels very comfortable to wear, doesn't feel drying at all, I really love the color, it makes me feel confident when I wear it. The only thing is that this lipstick doesn't dry down. The lip Lipstick would transfer onto everything my lips touch and my teeth. It's a bit annoying, but other than that, I really love this lipstick. And these are all my favorite red lipsticks. That's the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in my next one.